Hey guys, the Dark Underground Milkshake here, and welcome to my fourth Pokemon review. As you can see, we are reviewing one of the legends from Generation 1, Mew 2. This legend is a psychic type, and it has pressure and nervous type as its abilities. Its tier is Uber, which means if you want to do an OU battle, this Pokemon will be illegal. Stats for this Pokemon are very strong. All stats over 90, as you can tell. Defense and special defense being its weakest at 90. Have a special attack and speed is its priority start. HP and attack are right up there as well. It's mega. It's mega X form. It's a fighting psychic type. It's steady, fast. I don't even know said fast whatever that is. I've never seen that. That is what it looks like by the way. It's tier is Uber. And yeah, its stats are a lot better than its previous one. Defense, special defense and HP being its lowest with 100, 100, and 106. Special attack and speed with 130 and 154. And attack being its priority stat at 190. Mega Y, as you can tell, is a psychic type only. It's got insomnia and it's also in the Uber tier. It's stats, if I just pull them down so you can see them better. Oh, I'm going quick. Oh, yeah. Um. So I don't know what's happening there. The slow start is defense on 70. Then it's your HP. It seems to all have the same HP. Attack, special attack, special defense and speed are all, are all in the green with a good stats on each. And its priority stats is the special attack. The first move for it is, well style for it is special attacker. These are the moves, Side Strike and Focus Blast, two very powerful moves on a Mew 2. And Ice Beam, Shadow Ball, Electro Ball, Fire Blast, Dawn, on Calm Mind are the other moves you should use. Why for a Mew 2 Night Y, Pressure, Timid, and that's the um, EVs. So depending on what's what, if you want higher on the attack base, you'd use the Y4, but if you want to be a bit more stronger in general, you'd use the Mew 2 Y. So here's the Mewtwo X style. Here is the other one. Pressure, ability pressure, nature jolly, EVs 112, 144, 252. So I'm not me a lot. I've only just woken up. This should be recorded like in an hour or so. No, in that recorded. Uploaded in an hour or so. The moves for it is low kick, taunt, earthquake, ice punch, slash stone edge. Oop, I have gone way too far. You guys should see a part of my other video. Let's go down into the moves. So obviously, oh, my iPad's breaking on me again. Give me a second to fix that. So, if you guys can read that very well, I'm going to slowly go down on the list of moves. If there's any moves I see that would be expected on a Mewtwo, I'd say, like Calm Mind, Confusion, Disable. Dream Eater, Drain Punch, Dynamic Punch, Endure, Energy Ball, Fire Blast, Fire Punch. See, with a Mewtwo, it's very good because you can you don't have to rely on one type of moves, it, can, it has moves of all types. So, because the type was that, because the moves I use are Focus Blast, Psych, Psych Strike, Thunderbolt, and Electro Ball, uh, not Electro Ball, uh, Energy Ball. Well, so it has all the hidden powers. I don't get the point of hidden powers. I'm all hidden powers. High Beam, Ice Beam, Ice Punch, the yeah, moves you'd expect on it. Magic Coat, Magic Room. Wouldn't really see Magic Room on it as such. Because old items will have no effect and yeah. You'll probably have the life orb if you use that. Miracle Eye, Mist, Mud Slap, Natural Gift, Nightmare, Poison Grab, Power Swap, Power Up Punch, Protect, Psychic, Psychic Cut. There's just a brilliant amount of that. And obviously each of them if you look over there I've got their stats as well. I'm using smoking.com if you guys would want me to link the website if you want to see more of this yourself instead of just seeing what I've got. 
Obviously here is the other bits of moves. Sandstorm, interesting move. self destruct on a Mewtwo is not a move you'd use, but I guess it can learn it. That one you couldn't see really see very well. I don't know if I show you the types as well. Was Solar Beam up there. And then obviously these are the last two moves. Wonder Room and Zen Headbutt. That is all today. It's actually one of the longer ones. Obviously for some reason my Pokemon reviews got shorter and shorter. If you've got any Pokemon you'd like to do in the comments below. This one is a shout out to Inferno Nitro for suggesting this idea for me. For this one video. The next one should be either Skarmony or Torterra. However, if you guys want me to stock up on what Pokemon to get to do, please leave them in the comments below. And please like, subscribe, and enjoy your day. I'll see you later.